Here we have the flag detail. The flag detail is formed in line with the NCO carrying the flag in the center. Here, we have two rows in order to accommodate for the state flag. The front row is composed of the front and rear halyards and NCO, who is responsible for carrying the U.S. flag as you see here, folded flat against his or her chest. The back row is composed of the detail commander at center, carrying the Missouri state flag, and an additional halyard to the left. The detail commander will softly give command, forward, march. The flag detail will slowly march towards the base of the flag staff and mark time at designated area. The detail commander will softly give command, detail, halt, and then detail, post. The front row will make a right face and begin marching up the base of the flagpole, while the back row will make a left face and begin marching up the opposite side of the base of the flagpole. When the detail commander is even with the flagpole, the flag detail will begin to mark time. The detail commander will give the command, detail, halt, followed by the command, center, face. The detail commander will then give command, post. In unison, the NCO will take one step, while the front and rear halyards will take two steps, followed by a facing movement towards the flagpole. The halyards will then take a full step inwards. The front halyard takes the rope and secures the U.S. flag. Once the flag is secured, the halyards will raise the flag until it is out of grasp of the NCO. The NCO will then take a step back and the detail commander will take a step inward. The front halyard will then secure the Missouri state flag and both halyards will raise the flag until it is out of grasp of the detail commander. The detail commander will take a step back. The front halyard will signal and both the front and rear halyards will take three steps back and immediately begin raising the flags. All parties will render a salute. When the flag has reached the top of the pole, the front halyard will signal and at that signal, both halyards will drop their right hands and present arms. The detail commander will then give command, order, arms. The front halyard will signal again and the halyards will take three steps inward. The front halyard will ensure that the rope is not tangled with the flag and will secure the rope to the pole. At this time, the front halyard will signal and both halyards will perform a facing movement, taking two steps outward. At this time, all parties will follow the rear halyard signal to perform a facing movement and begin marching away from the base of the flagpole. The flag detail will align themselves in the same formation as when first arriving at the base of the flag staff. All parties will mark time until detail commander gives command, detail, halt. followed by immediate facing movement of the entire detail. Detail commander will give command, forward, march. Detail will begin marking time at designated area, and detail commander will then give command, detail, halt, followed by fallout. 